Yes, yes, there is. First of all, most of the things that have led to an increase of our cost of living fall on the jurisdiction of the provincial and municipal governments. Trudeau is part of a minority government. So if you don't feel like you're being represented on the federal level, you might want to pick a bone with your own party. Like you want to whine about Trudeau sending $8 billion to Ukraine from the foreign aid budget that was already allocated for foreign aid. And sending money to your allies is how you strengthen those relationships. And whether you like it or not, because you've fallen for Russian propaganda, the majority of the world is on Ukraine's side. So yeah, we help out a bit with the annexation of their land. And if you don't like that, but you were still consistent and criticized Doug Ford for the green belt, the fact that he lost over $4 billion in COVID relief funds, just poof, disappeared. Don't know where it went. Cut 40 plus billion dollars from hospitals, education. So this is seriously what I don't get. We're not saying Trudeau's a good option. We're just saying that the conservatives are never the better option. But you'll say that Trudeau is making life harder for the average Canadian while simultaneously in the same breath defending conservative premiers trying to turn our healthcare into the archaic United States model. Like, I get it. I'm not harping on you. Times are tough. Life sucks. We're not being represented. But going for the even more brazenly corrupt party leads to me to believe one of two things. Either you're incredibly misinformed and you're a low information voter and you get duped very easily online. Two, you love the fucking bigotry. And that's, to be honest, what a lot of you are. Bigots. When Doug Ford adopted the anti-trans rhetoric today, you guys were all foaming at the mouth. When we all know that any kid that is part of the LGBTQ community is less safe with conservative parents. Anyway, you have a wonderful day, eh? And keep having fights with me online instead of contacting your members of parliament. I'm sure that'll work.